Good evening, everyone. Welcome back. College football, that is a big topic of discussion over the last week or so with conference realignments and mergers. July, always a big month. Media Day, upcoming soon. Teams around the country getting ready to start the fall camp. That includes the Indiana State Sycamores will begin fall practice less than a month. We are so excited. Head coach Kurt Mallory in the trees where we'll report to fall camp on August 2nd. First day of practice set for August 3rd. Sycamores coming off a busy spring that saw them push their spring game back a bit due to the weather. They were able to navigate the practice sessions healthy after a big summer, it's almost time to get ready for those first practices and prepare for a big season opener Thursday, September 1st against North Alabama. Here is Coach Mal on ISU trying to keep that momentum high after, of course, beating Illinois State to end the season and having a solid spring session. It'll come down to our leadership, you know, our senior leadership. We got leadership in every room, you know, guys like Dante Hendricks and Jose Vasquez. And, uh, you know, you're going to see that. Lucas Hunter, you know, Johnny May, Jeffrey Brown, Jonathan Edwards, you know, guys that have played a lot of football and how they lead this team, especially over the summer. Here's a look at the Sycamore schedule. The first five games, tough stretch, but hey, that's the way they want it. ISU will open it up Thursday the 1st against North Alabama, 6 p.m. at Memorial Stadium, and they have nine days before they head to West Lafayette, seeing Purdue on Saturday, September 10th at 4 Eastern. That game will be on the Big Ten Network as well. Sycamores come back home for their final non-conference game. It is a big one against a very good Montana program on the 17th at 1. Valley play begins Saturday, October 1st at Northern Iowa at 5, and it's back to Memorial on Saturday, October 8th at Sycamore host the always powerful and strong North Dakota State Bison at one college football just right around the corner for Indiana State.